Hi, and welcome along to the Bias Premier League show brought to you today by Boohoo Man. As we say every single week, you can get yourself an extra 10% off all Boohoo Man wear by using the code AFTV10. You can get stuff like what I've got in here. Love this. What Yardy's wearing, what Ty's wearing. After he eventually put it on, after rocking up here <laughs> in all of his Arsenal gear. That's but what... check it out right now. They've got some <laughs> great stuff for spring. Um, you can either scan the QR code on the screen or uh, click the link in the description right now. Um, and big up to Boohoo Man. We've actually yeah, got Sean from what... Boohoo Man in the studio. So big up to Sean. Yeah. Man. Big up. <laughs> Sean, who, by the way, is a big Manchester United fan. Huh? Now, Sean, it's all right. I won't talk about him. Because, uh, <laughs> we want to keep the contract. <laughs> but boy, United, man. Did they get away with one at the weekend? But we're going to talk about the other Manchester club and Arsenal. Um, mm. Me and Ty was at the game yesterday yeah, at the Etihad actually. Stadium. It yeah. finished nil-nil. Yeah. To a neutral fan watching it, it probably was a bit of a bore fest. It weren't yeah. the most exciting games. For me as an Arsenal fan, and I'm going to get these guys' opinion, I thought, I'll have that. Good mm. point. Difficult place to go to. I think, and I've said this a few times, probably the hardest place to go right now in world football and get a result is Manchester City at the Etihad because it's such a good side. You know when you go there, you're not going to not have the possession. They're going to have the possession. You know how tough it's going to um, be with the calibre of players they've got. But I thought that we shackled them. Haaland, non-existent. De Bruyne, non-existent. Yeah. Silva shackled. Rodri. You know, Rodri, I think Rodri was the better of yeah. their players. He, he played well. And I Foden, thought Foden. the defence, Foden shackled, <laughs> got hooked. The defensive performance Greenish. by Arsenal was brilliant. And actually, we could have nicked that game. You should have. But I will take a point there all day long. It's the hardest game, you know, on paper when you looked at our remaining fixtures. Yeah. And Arsenal still in the title race, not top at the moment. Two points off it now. Liverpool are top after their win against Brighton. But Yardi, that was a decent point yesterday. Yeah, um, like, like you said, from a neutral, I even just watching that, well, it was one of them games where uh, there wasn't a lot really happening in terms of in front tense, of goal. Yeah, it was, it, but... But this is what happens when, you, when two teams who are fighting for the title in the title race are going up. We know these are the type of games that you're going to have. If we even look at the Liverpool-Man City games, they both, both their games have been draw games. They, yeah. they've draw with each other 1-1. So we, we did the same thing. You know what I mean? Only thing we didn't, nobody scored. We went, first team we, to stop them yeah, from scoring. Yeah, scoring over 50-something games. Yeah. In three years, they're saying. First 57, team, 57, 57, 57 stop games. Stop them from scoring at the end. Stop them from scoring. had nothing, nothing. Like, Haaland... <laughs> Was, was out of the game. Gabriel and, and, and Sleeper was just passing him. You want William. him? No, you take him. You want him? No, you take him. <laughs> like, they, 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 he, he was confused. He was rattled throughout the game. Um, uh. let, I, I look at it like this. As long as we didn't lose that game, I was okay with that. Because, yes, it is, one of, it, it is, it is the toughest game we had left out of the 10, right? And that's, not, that, that's no disrespect to other team. It's just facts. It's what mm. it is. This is the team, the treble winning team, the world... They won the world um, football. What well, they won the day, Super Cup, right? Mm. So they've won everything. You understand what I mean? They haven't, they haven't had a divisible team. <laughs> they won everything. You so know what I mean? Won so we are going up against them. They, they complain and say, oh, Stones was out, Walker was out. They you have the squad in the world, over apparently. 200 million defenders there together assembled against us. Stop complaining. Stop complaining, right? It just is what it is. We're still in the race. There's nine games left. I, I think if. If there was, um, if that game was only our third to last, like three games left in the season, and that was our third to last game of the season, I would be disappointed with that result. But because of how many games I've left, and every team still has nine teams to, uh, nine more games mm. to go, I feel like a point it's is put respected. It in perspective as well. Yeah. You know I mean, no one's beaten them there this season. No you know one I mean? has. It's a really, really tough place to go to, yep. and I thought that we went there, and you know. You know, we, we, we gave Clean a great shoot, account man. of ourselves. And we've now played them and Liverpool mm -hmm. um, twice this season. We've yep. taken four points off them. Yep. We, we, we beat both of them at home and drew both of them away. Yep. Yep. People forget that. We played City three times this season. <laughs> we haven't lost to them. Nope, the nope. Community Shield. I know it's a Community Shield, yeah. but we won it. And it was yeah. a draw in full time. Yeah. We beat them at home yep. and we've drawn with them today. Could potentially, if results go both of uh, our ways. For, 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 the, for you the other day as well and, and sat them, man. Saturday what? And um, social Saturday. Oh, so oh, so no, big up, big up, Robbie. Let me tell you, deal with it. Defend my team, bro. Uh, hold on, I, 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 I did say it'd be a draw on that no, show, didn't I? No, you did, but what, what's the Man City fan? 
Boovy. Yeah, I, I bet you Boovy right now, you would no, be happy better. if you got a deflected goal yesterday. You'll be <laughs> celebrating. You wouldn't be saying, oh, deflected goal. That's what he kept saying to you. Deflected goal. I know. Deflected what? goal, you still get the goal and get three points. The thing is about you it, right, is that you, I could tell his nervous energy on the show, right? Yeah. That he was nervous. <laughs> when I got up to City yesterday, there was a different feeling about it because normally yeah. you go up to City, when you speak to their fans, it's almost like they're expecting a standard win, which yeah. they do normally get. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This time, I was up there and they were like, yeah, tough game today. Yeah, I was thinking, boy, they, they, they sound a bit different today because yeah. they know that this is a different Arsenal. And, you know, I, I think Arsenal, like you said, we're well in this title race. And any of the three teams, Liverpool, Arsenal or Man City can still win it. Each City are not out of it because of yesterday. No. They've still got the quality to go on a great run. They've been on a great run as well. So, so we, but we're in it. Yeah. And that's the thing that matters for us. Um, Ty, you was at the game. I was. First of all, I need to know, right? <laughs> I saw you at the end of the game. I was about <laughs> five rows up from you. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's right. Um, some boy told me that you're there. I actually saw you. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Yeah, What's yeah. the matter with you? Why were you there reacting to those City fans, because we were sat <laughs> right near the City fans. That's what I say. Stood up right near the City on, fans on, there on, on the on next end, ring. On this end. guy now, <laughs> I mean, they were trying to banter me all game. All I could hear him say is, Robbie, Robbie, Robbie. <laughs> <laughs> like, and I, I could see him out the corner of my eye and I said, I'm just ignoring him. I'm just ignoring them. I know they want a reaction. <laughs> However, there's somebody who's very easy to get a reaction from. <laughs> yep. Who starts jumping around and that at the end After of the, the game, game Got Jump around, House of Pain, yeah. I heard you, I heard, I heard you, I heard you run from, from, from the House of Pain, yeah. Where he was sitting, he run all the way no, up to that's, the yes. side. That's where you are wrong as well. So you got it wrong as well. I'm just telling you what I heard. No, what, just what like you heard. You, so I, you didn't see it then? No, so I saw the heard. video of you getting dragged back. Okay, oh, I did see that so you, video. So you said, I ran round. Because that's what no, Robbie said. No, I said you run to the Because if you remember, we were on the end. Now, you first of all, no, but you weren't no, right we were on the end. end. No, I was right on the end. You were right on the end. I was, well, I was you right left from end. where you was. No, no, to I come was to the right end. on the end because the explain only... what happened then. Tell okay, you hold tell on, me. Hold on. So there was so on the end there was the other man for support club and me. So I didn't have to move. I was right on the end. First of all, yeah, fair enough. I will apologise to AFTV. Fair enough. That's all. And yeah, I apologize. again. Yeah, and 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 again, listen. Villa. Um, what was the other game? <laughs> Newcastle game. Newcastle. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Brighton, 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 Bournemouth, Brighton, 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 so why, so why do you feel acting like that? Well, I said, okay then. I didn't say nothing all the way. When it finished now, I just went up and showed my badge. I don't know what the problem was. I mean, there's a badge <laughs> yeah, on my yeah. shirt. There's a badge on my shirt. Weird, so you yeah. go up to them. I showed them my badge. Yeah. No, but oh yeah. Isn't that what people do? You're a player, yeah? No, no, I'm not. I said you do the knee slide in front no. of them, yeah. <laughs> it's good, good. I'm, I'm, yeah. Not, I'm, I'm not like Joe. I'm not a player. I don't so want to do, be playing so, no more. So, so let me so just ask you, like let me just ask you this, right? Yeah. The City fans are upset. First I'm time, about what? First time they've not seen. They're their lucky team. they didn't lose. First time they've not seen their team score. You're damn right. Um, at home in, 80, in eight, eight, 882 days. Right, and also, <laughs> um, you know, knowing that you know for the title race they really <laughs> needed to win. They kind of needed to win to get back the advantage. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Didn't. Yeah. So they're pretty yeah. upset, and then you oh. come up to them, start kissing badges and that. Yeah. Oh, you don't right. think that's going to provoke them? Oh, they're upset. Oh my gosh, my golly gosh. Now let me think. When they won 4 1, what were they saying? If I remember quite rightly, and you can correct me, they came jumping, you say, Robbie, Robbie, what's the score? No. And did I react? But well, were you upset? I was upset. Okay, then. But I didn't so, react. So the boots are number four now, isn't it? It's all right for them, isn't it? The boots now, could have been in your head yeah. if those police Bro weren't there Robbie, to why, separate Robbie, everybody. Why are you, right? The boot wouldn't have been on Robbie, the other foot. Why the boot you, would be in your mouth. Robbie, why Bro, are you, you, got, that? you cannot react. Yeah, but Robbie, don't say No, that. listen. It's facts. Oh, it's football. It's we know what football's question, like. It's not facts. Yeah, no, 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 no
listen, like I said, I already apologised. You know, do you know what I had to deal with against West Ham? I had to deal with them at Emirates, but because of Emirates, they were cussing me all game at Emirates, and I couldn't say nothing because I've got to be on my best behaviour at Emirates. They were cussing me, cussing me, cussing me. Before the, that's what I'm saying. And now, I didn't say nothing. I'm going, and they're right, swearing see, at I'm me before to you. the game. Tight. They're swearing at me Tight. before I'm the game. I'm trying to explain to you, yeah? It's football. You've been going for a very long time. I, I know what it's like. I've, you know these guys, they're trying to get a reaction. But right? when they get it, you don't have complain. to ignore it. And that's fine. I just want to know fine. how does he hear the abuse with that's two fine. headphones on, <laughs> listening to three different <laughs> radio stations, that's listening fine. to all these different <laughs> music. Fine. How do you hear the abuse you're, with your and, headphones and, and, and on? Like? Also, you're actually wrong. You're actually wrong. It's free headphones. Yeah. It's the headphones. It's absolute And you still 80s. hear the abuse? It's absolute 80s in one I'm ear. I'm starting to question if you even it's hear it. Ab- it's absolute 80s in Lip reading. Lip reading. It's absolute 80s in one Did you say that? He it's just abs- told me that. No. It's absolute 80s in one ear and absolute 90s in the other ear. So how you hear absolute abuse? No. <laughs> no. What it is, Johnny, I can hear everything. That's what I'm saying. When we <laughs> lost, when we lost to West, when we absolute lost, abuse, FM. When we lost to West, <laughs> when we, but the thing is, we shouldn't, we shouldn't make joke because abuse is serious subject. We know oh, about how do you hear it? Then. No, but, but anyway, I, mean, I want to move it. I want to move it on. But what did you think of the performance? Okay, okay. The performance was absolutely superb. And the funny thing is, listen. It's very interesting because I was in the bar, but shout out DNLs, Darren, Taper, Ren, and Damon. And I would say, we're going to the, they said, you're going to Etihad. And I said, so? And people said, oh, you're going to Etihad. And I said, so? We don't disrespect Man City, but we know what we can do. We've had the best form since January, you know? And I was even expecting, I, was, I, I didn't even expect Gabriel and William to wrap up Harlow like that. I was thinking, boy, David's going to have to make saves and all that. He had one save to make. In yep. the whole game, can you imagine? He yep. had nothing to do. We had the better chances. And I, and I even said, and I, I, I could not see us not winning. And even though I agree it's a great defence performance, to me, I think we should have won. And I'm disappointed that we shouldn't have won because we had the clear cut chances. Leo mm. had a chance as well. We had the clear cut chances. I thought it was fascinating. It just shows, like you said, I knew it was a different energy. I knew it was a different energy because now we're challenging, but we've also learned. But it's so, I, I, I think it's... Me and you spoke about yeah. it downstairs before. We said, I feel Arsenal is just missing that one up for, like a, a, work, a striker, MJ a player that, that, that can, can make something out of nothing. Do you understand what I mean? Because what we can see with our team right now, the defence, we, we, uh, you know my praises for Gabriel is very high. And William. And, and William as well. No, no, I'm wrong. And William. Ben White was good but yesterday. Ben so White. And Kivio. Yeah. And Kivio. Yeah. Going back four mm. there. Was super. Like, and, and it just shows Declan like. Declan Rice as well. With, with, oh, with, amazing. With amazing, ta- amazing. Tommy still, Tommy Yasu came on. Mm. You know, we, Tommy still, we, we still have. You say Tommy still? No, Tommy Yasu. <laughs> I was saying, I was Tommy saying still. Um, Timber still to come into the team. <laughs> you really, well. yeah. I feel like we have a, a, a defensive, solid defensive partnership yeah. here that now we just need. You know, bringing in Declan Rice has shown the difference this season oh, as well. incredible. You know, in terms of, like we said, got four points off our rivals, it's should quite... we say, in the title race. And it's just up front, I feel like, once we get that one piece up front that we need, this team will be challenging, yeah. man. So as, it stands, be challenging. Um, as it stands, Liverpool top, um, two points yeah. ahead of us now. But if we win, um, we're we in go second back place. Top, um, we'll and in third place, um, it is now Manchester City, just a point back from <laughs> yeah. us. Um, so it's extremely tight. The next game, set of games coming up, um, midweek games, yep, Arsenal, yeah. Luton at home. Yeah. You know, you never want to say anything, but you'd expect Arsenal to win that. Absolutely. Uh, I think Liverpool got Sheffield United. Yeah. You'd yep. expect them to win that. Yeah. Um, tricky little game for, for uh, City. They've got Villa. Villa. It is at yes. home, though. Yeah. And we know how strong they are at home, but Villa right. did beat them early on in the season. And look at Villa defensively. So that's going to be an interesting game as well. We'll be. So, we'll be. This title race is so, so tight, it could go anywhere. But I think what Arsenal showed yesterday is that they are right in it and they showed their credentials, that they are tough, they're strong and resilient and they are not going to be anybody's pushover. Absolutely. The other um, thing we've got to mention um, is that the Arsenal women, congratulations. Congratulations. Well done to them. Um, They had a really tough game as well yesterday in the final. Um, of the Conti Cup, they took on Chelsea, who currently yes. you say the best team yeah. um, they were on for the in the country. Yeah, they? We're on for the quadruple. Uh, yeah. and, uh, the quadruple of nothing, yeah. It was uh, Stina <laughs> Emma, Black Stinius. Where's your apology? Stina, Stina yeah. Black Stinius Emma, with, where's your with apology? a goal right near <laughs> oh, the end of the game in extra time. <laughs> yes. Arsenal winning the Conti Cup by a goal to nil. Congratulations, to retain it. Guys. To retain yeah. it. And to retain it. 
and that's the, sorry, Robbie. That's the <laughs> second time we've beaten Chelsea it's in the, the final. Net. Yeah, and he's going on about a little. There was a little incident at the end. No, where, it wasn't another. Um, Jonas no, came over. No, it was not to, a little. He's the manager no, of Arsenal Women to no, shake the hand no, of Emma Hayes. No. Chelsea manager, and no. she pushed him away. No, yeah. it's not. Robbie. She, did, she did that time. Robbie, I'm sorry. No, she did a Dini. <laughs> but, but the only thing is, she should have been set off when the game was finished. But no, no, Robbie, the thing is, it's not a little incident. I'm sorry to interrupt. It's not well, a, it's little a little incident. It's a little push. She, no, she didn't go no, like that. She, no. She just sort of went like no, that. Robbie, no, because the reason why is if Jonas had did that, as soon as he came off the pitch, the police would be waiting for him with handcuffs. <laughs> Police, come on! Because clearly, it, was, no, it wasn't no, like a shovel. No, but she that she spoke about male aggression. If that's a man pushing a woman, how would that be perceived? This is what I'm saying. That's true. It is absolutely. But it wasn't. A, come on! It was a. No, it's it wasn't a shovel. It was a. No, but that's no, but the thing is, you can be annoyed. You can, you're exaggerating. That no, no, I'm, no, I'm not because I'm looking at what she said. She said she had the guts to mention male aggression. But you're the one that pushed him. So what about female aggression then? You're the one that he didn't push her. You mentioned male aggression. You aggression. You bring it there. It's disgusting. But the funny thing is, what she's done in her, um, probably the last final she's going to play in England, it shows everything about Emma in a nutshell. Disrespectful, rude, arrogant, bad loser, Bitter. But she's a bad loser cowardly. because she's. No, wait, hold on. Cowardly. Hold Sorry. On. So, uh, obviously, she's I'm talking a... about in football terms. Fo- <laughs> yeah. in coward, Listen, cowardly. In football terms. I've actually, I've actually met her. She was so a nice So, if I used to chat to her, she was a nice lady. I used to be cool. Right, yeah. I used to chat to her. Outside, yeah, I used to chat to her. No, I used to. She was a. Oh, she was. She was. I used to chat to her. She was. I used to be cool. What I put it down to is this, right? Sound like Yaka some feelings. What I'm losing. What I put it down to is this. She's got feelings. She's a winner. She's a winner. She won yesterday, innit? She doesn't like losing, and she's a Nobody winner. Likes. So that's why she. But she is a brilliant manager, the, Robbie. The she thing. is a brilliant manager. I, I, I was saying the other day that I would like to see Emma Hayes manage a Premier League team. I mm-hmm. think she's good enough. <laughs> I know she's going off now. She's going to manage um, America, mm. the USA team, mm. which is a that's a massive job in women's football. Mm-hmm. But I think she can manage in the Premier League. I think she's good enough. But she don't That's like losing, not, and I don't. You're exaggerating. No, I'm not. Little, ex- no, I'm not like exa- a little thing like I'm that. Not exa- I'm not exaggerating because she said she mentioned male aggression. But you're the one that pushed. If Jonas had pushed her, what would have been said? What would have been said if Jonas had pushed her away? This is what I'm saying. Oh gosh. It's not. No, it's it's ridiculous. It's ridiculous comments. And I was, and I go so far as to say she's trivializing male aggression in the wrong way. That's a trivialization. Because that's not really mainly affecting me, no, really. No, it's no, really no, affecting you. Didn't, it right. didn't affect me. Because I was laughing. Like, right right no, now, I'm, I'm sensing a lot of male aggression on the culture. A lot of you, 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 can, you can make a joke. The people that are beaten up are not laughing, are they? They still scarred, <laughs> they, they still bear the bruises. So that's what I'm saying. Yeah. So when you talk about things like that, this uh, worms, worms, Anyway, wait, wait a minute. I always just got to say, um, you know, Frida Marnham, who yes. collapsed in the game. Hearts of um, Get well right? soon. Um, they, she didn't actually have to go to hospital. So hopefully. She didn't. It maybe was just nothing too serious, but um, okay. and once again, congratulations to Arsenal. Oh, well done, yeah, man. First, one, um, one the first trophy of the thing, and the yeah. thing is, and the well thing done. is, time is still ticking. Emma, the apology's got to come in now. Jonas <laughs> deserved the apology. The thing about it is that I'm going to say I think the WSL should ban her. Go to America now. Oh leave, 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 leave now. No, oh no, it's ter- because it's it's a, it's a terrible thing to say. Can you imagine if Jonas had pushed her and said female aggression? What would have happened? Uh, can you imagine? Yanni. Yeah. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Who is your boohoo Disgrace. man of the week? Disgrace. Boohoo man of the week for me, uh, I want to big up our defence, Gabriel yeah. and Ansaliba. William S. And, and, um, and Jakub. Yeah, I, and ben. I said the defence. And Takeo. I said the defence, but we have to talk about Gabriel and, no. and, and um, Saliba. That partnership yeah, yeah. they have. Amazing. We already said that these guys do have the potential to be the best. And we can see it. They they have they have to be reckoned as one of the best partnerships in the world, if not the yeah. best at the moment, because the yeah. League, they came sure. up against yeah. the the best scoring team in the world and and Ooh, stopped them, them yeah. twice this season. So, yeah. so you, you have to look at that as well and and, and mm. say, hey, these guys are, are the real business. Are the best. And I hope it continues. I watched a little Hopefully. clip they had as well on the same show you was on, yeah. where they were seeing if they knew each other, and it was just yeah. funny to see. Yeah. All, even though they were talking to each other and stuff yeah. like that, it's funny, and I love to see that with our team. Mm. And hopefully these guys can carry on. But I'm going to give it to Arteta. 
Boo mm. man of the week. I'm going to give to Arteta for doing what you did this season. Yep. You have improved the team. We can tell. Yeah. Right? We got four points off of Liverpool and we got four points off of City. So we're learning and you're learning. The team's learning and you're doing a great job. And I feel like you went there yesterday and you could have went out and, and, and said, go for it, go for it. You could have told the players to go for it. You would have lost the game. Maybe, no, maybe, maybe, maybe actually, have. we don't know. But if you went for it, you had a higher chance of losing that game. And a higher and chance of you, winning. And, and if you did lose it, then people will be coming and saying, you haven't learned anything from last season. Yeah. They'll be saying, see this, see that, rare, all this stuff. See this. You went and did a job yesterday. And if we even go down to this, and I don't really like to carry on like that and go back to things, but when you look back to the Newcastle game where that goal should have been disallowed, the Villa game where Kai Havertz goal should have stood, Eddie, I think it was. we would have been on top right now. Mm. So we'd have done, we've done our job against the, our, our closest rivals, the teams mm. that we're in the race with. Mm. It's unfortunate that those decisions went our way early in the season and Didn't go away. Two, put us two points off. Mm. But overall, Arteta, I feel like you're doing a great job right now right. Yeah. and you get it. Mikel Arteta, boo well done, man of the week. Yeah. Who's your idiot of the week? And you're not allowed Emma to Hayes. include Toy. Emma Hayes. <laughs> Emma Hayes. <laughs> Emma Hayes. <laughs> Emma Hayes, Emma Hayes, Emma Hayes, Emma Hayes. Idiot of the week. What do you mean me? Is going My to go. My fans. The idiot of the week is going to go to the one and only. Emma Hayes. Manchester United. Again. Yes, man. Sean's in it, man. He's going to cancel the contract. I don't care. You know, listen. These guys. You don't yeah, care. These guys. You don't care. They score. They score in the 95th minute or whatever. Hold out the game and get the three points. You're trying to get that, that final Champions League spot. You're, you could be getting fourth. I had you guys down to get fourth and take Tottenham out of the top four. I mm. want you to chase them down and well, get them out. You forget about Aston Villa. Eh? You forget about Aston Villa. No, I don't care if Villa in there. I don't want Tottenham in the top four. I'd rather Villa yeah, than Yeah, but Villa them. are higher than all of them. No. Yes. Yeah, yes. Yeah. Uh, yeah, that's fine yeah. though. Exactly, that's What's fine. What's it's, if, they, if they could Man, catch anybody, Man, Man United, could, though, if they yeah, would have got a win, yeah, that'd mm, been good for that them. That would have been the be biggest good. robbery since the Great Train Robbery. <laughs> the amount of <laughs> chances <laughs> that Brentford had, right? <laughs> Brentford should have been about four nil up. Yeah, I mean, yeah. that would have been the biggest robbery I've ever seen yeah. in football. Smash and grab. Well, like, worse than worse than two thousand and one. Worse, man. Did you watch Worse that in 2001? Game. Honestly, no, like they no. did nothing in but the whole score, game. Just hold out the game. But, and then just, you, you just do hold score, out. hold on to it. Just um, hold on to it. Yeah. You only had another five minutes to see You game. think they could do anything against Liverpool next season? Oh. Next week? Next this season? weekend? <laughs> next week. Of course. <laughs> listen, they're different listen when they're let me do one of Robbie's, let me they're do one of Robbie's speeches. Manchester United, huh? this is the time. This is your time to believe. Believe <laughs> that you can do it. You can stop Liverpool. Beat them this weekend. Just slap them up. 1-0, 2-0, 2-1. Doesn't matter. I'm sorry, I'm not doing a believe on that. Believe. <laughs> I already got enough stick for last year's one at City, right? And I'm just recovering from that now. <laughs> believe for Man United? <laughs> no. Right? Uh, we got some questions in the Ask Tie. I, the, the question, right. uh, well, I've got a thing. Emma, where is your apology? Oh, God. If you Carla, talk about it, 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 who? You used to talk to her. Yeah. Right. I used to talk to her. Question for to. Ty. And this one's coming from uh, David Parrin. Mm. He says, question for Ty. Yeah, thank you, David. Um, if you have to sign one player from each of the top four, who would oh, it be? Oh, my gosh. Like, Obviously, is... you can't sign from Arsenal because we're in the top four. So, it'd be so, so City, a player from Man City, City, Liverpool. Yeah. a player from Liverpool, and Villa. a player from Villa. Yeah. Oh my! What Just throw Spurs in there as well. Come on, do it quick. Oh my! Right, so a player from City. Player from City, obviously Harlan. A player from Liverpool. Liverpool, Salah. Villa. Villa. Ooh. Ooh. That's Oof. a bit difficult. You've got. Sign uh, back, Emmy. Uh, yeah, probably go with. Um, actually, no, 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 because David is there now, so no. Um, probably Watkins because he's a good. All right, and finally. Tottenham. Nobody. Uh, what? Let me think. No, one player from Tottenham. Yeah, Come nobody. That's the name of the player. Uh, no, you I don't, don't play there no more. <laughs> <laughs> You're right. Uh, I don't He's even, like Bayern Munich now. I don't even know. Oh, oh uh, God, I don't, even, I don't even know this top of the team. Uh, Son? Who? What? No. Uh, Madison? No, definitely not. Madison Avenue, yeah. Charleston? A great group. No. Bro, uh, nobody. I know Jed, Jed Spence, and he's not—he's on loan. 
<laughs> Thank you for the question. Right. Um, <laughs> another view says, um, he's got a question. He says, yeah. Well, actually, no, he says, well done, Ty. Midnight, zero, zero, zero is the start of the day. <laughs> 23.59 is the end of the day. Now, remember, we, Thank had, this, you so we had this big debate last Thank week. Thank you so much. We were talking about midnight. Thank you and so much. And I have to say, much. right, everybody in the comments is back in time and saying that midnight well, is midnight. Well, I don't care. Wrong. Midnight is <laughs> you still don't. midnight. Hold on. Midnight, midnight is midnight. Uh, it's, hold, the end. it's the night. It's hold, the hold night. On. Midnight. I'm, 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 you I'm, also I'm, had another person backing you up here. Uh, <laughs> Deuta C-O-Y-G says, Thank you. a 24-hour day ends at 11.59. Then the clock strikes 12 a.m., a.k.a. midnight. A new day has begun. So Ty is right in saying midnight Sunday. No, he's not right. Thank because you. Thank one, you. Minute past mid one minute past 12 is the start of the new day. Yeah. This is where everybody in the comments now, you're getting it wrong. 24 hours is in a day, yeah. right? Yeah, so one minute right? past midnight. Yeah. Is the new day. But I didn't midnight. say that. No. I said it ends 11.59. I said, he said, the idea said to me, when does the day end? I said 11.59. That's what I said. And I said midnight is when it's finished. No, but I said 11.59 uh, is when it ends. You know what I'm saying? I didn't say when it starts. If there's 24 it... hours in a day, right? Yeah. If there's 24 hours in a day, yeah. and if it ends at 11.59, yes. that means it's finishing at 11 hour, um, um, 23 hours and 59 minutes. Yes. So where's that extra and minute going? 59 seconds. So that's just one second, isn't it? <laughs> That's just one second. Right. Final question here. <laughs> this one is coming from um, Bro Arsenal. He yeah. says, question for Tyrone. No, my name right. is Tyrone. <laughs> no, 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 no. Next. No, I'm not answering that question. He you says... No, I'm not answering the question. No, I'm not answering the question. If you can't address my name properly, forget it. I'm not answering the question. I don't care. I'm not answering uh, the question. for Ty. Ty. No, right. no, I'm not asking the question. He Bobby. says, no, right? no, I'm not asking the question. He I'm says, the, uh, the Invincibles I'm are not the greatest question. team ever. I'm not asking the question. But would the Invincibles go in beaten in the league in any of the last five seasons? He says, me personally, I would say no chance. The league is far more competitive now than it was 20 years ago. Love the show. I tune in every week. Okay. Then I'll answer this. You can message back and tell me what team you support, then I'll answer. Next. I can tell you what team is. His name's called Bra Arsenal. So he's obviously an Arsenal supporter. Yeah, well, bro, is he, Arsenal. Is he, but what? But did what? Right. Now he's asking you the question. Would, would you know? Yeah. I, well, you know what? Yeah. You, well. Did he really say Tyrone? Or are you saying that? No, he's questioning for Tyrone. No, he's no well, I don't want to know then. Goodbye. <laughs> I mean, you call can't my name properly. The I man watches the show every no, week. No, call my name properly. You know Maybe my name. Never knew the you. name Maybe is Taiwan. You know my name is Taiwan. You, you know can't my name disrespect is the audience. No. What? The man's what? asking a question. No. Why mention Taiwan? My name is Taiwan. If you can't be bothered to address my name properly, I don't have to ask you a question. Next. Who are you? Who is he to who is he to call Taiwan? Call my name properly. My name it's is Taiwan. It's only a bit of banter. Oh, no, no. Yeah, next time you, when you ask, say, it's say, say bad man type. Save that, save that banter for the non-comedian yardie. Save that for him. <laughs> no, no, no. The thing I is, give no, up, man. No, I no, give no, up. No, no, listen. Don't oh, give I up. I will ask a question, but call my name properly, please. Call my name properly. Bad man Now, type. for you, no, for you, I'll yeah, answer the question. Type. For you. For you, I'll answer the question. So, what did he say again? I can't remember what he said. Say what he said again. <laughs> Basically saying, if this the Invincible teams, oh would they have gone invincible in the last five seasons? In what? Had? In the Premier League? Yeah. yeah. You're damn skipping, they would have. You're damn skipping, because that team is incredible. Boy, if that team... Centurions play of Manchester City, yep. treble winners, yep. the Liverpool side. Yep. yep. Up against those teams who would have gone invincible. Absolutely, 100%. And not, not, not what it is, is that Haaland would have been taken off at half-time. Actually, you know what? The... I'd, I'd also You're throw in, right. I'd also throw in this to the to that gentleman there, right? Mm. This season, those two teams have not beaten us. Exactly. We beaten them at home and we drawn with them away. As so, you see, you know, so, so say we would have beaten if that invincible team would have done the same. But, but you see the point. You see the point to that is like I hear this question comes up quite a few times. Mm. People always say, "Oh, how would they do? How would these teams do back then in the invincible exactly. time?" Exactly. You have to look at it Very both ways question. because you're talking about the teams of that generation. Okay, put that team back into that season with Arsenal going invincible. Would they even be, you understand, competing? I so, think, and so I'm going to throw it out here, maybe this is a question, question yeah. to ask you guys. I personally think the invincible team is better than that Centurion City team. Yeah. Yeah. It's better than every team. Right. Because they went Thierry on the Patrick, no, 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 Gilberto, no. Yeah. Right, but look, Lauren, I'm throwing it out there to you guys. Jens. Right? I'll throw it out there to you guys. Martin, Listen, guys, I so, um, want to big you both up. Thank you. I um, also want to say a big thank you going out to yeah. Sean 
from Boo Man. Thank you, Sean. Thank you, Boo Man. Um, Boo Man, by the way, been sponsoring the show for a very long time. Man. Yeah, they we have. really do appreciate we that. We do, we do. Thank right. you, Boo Man. I know you appreciate all the free clothes, innit? Am I the only one that gets it? <laughs> well, am I the only one that gets free clothes? Am I the only right. one that gets it? And uh, of course, like all of our of episodes, this episode brought to you by Boohoo Man. You can get an extra 10% off all of their clothing, all their menswear right now. All you've got to do is use the code AFTV10 to do that. Scan the QR code on the screen or click the link in the description. They've got a great selection for the spring. So make sure you check that out right now. Yardi, Big thanks up. to you. Thanks to you, Ty. We look Thank forward you, to the Robin. game. On Wednesday night, Arsenal taking on Luton yep. Town. Before I go, quick prediction. Uh, um, hopefully, 3 0 to us. Hello, he's doing 5 0. 5 0. I'll go 2 0. 2 0 to five Arsenal. Nil. I'm oh. um, looking forward to that game it's on Wednesday MR night. Yep. Lots of games yeah, coming okay. thick and fast. Bayern Munich <laughs> next week. Bayern Munich. Uh, uh, Bayern, by the way. Let, let's, just, let's just go to Bayern, by the way, they, they, they got beaten by Dortmund. I know. I know. Yeah. Title race probably over for them. Yeah. It is. Prediction? For well, that game. Usually I say, you, you took my finger. Actually, you know what? Leave it. Leave it. Yeah, Wait until okay. next yeah. week. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Wait until next week. Let's do one at a time. We're going to be okay. right in front of that. Yeah, let's okay. see what the game in front of us right now. We've got two yeah. games before that, no? Yeah, we have. Right in the yeah. way as well. Yeah, Guys, yeah. thanks for watching the show. Well, thank and you we'll see much. you next week.